wabarakatuhu. Today our topic is conditions required for effective counseling. In the counseling relationship, the following conditions are essential. The counselee should psychologically accept the counsellor. If the counselee doesn't accept the counsellor, then the relationship cannot continue. And the counselee will not share their personal details with the counsellor. Their personal emotional life will not be shared with the counsellor. Therefore, the first thing is that they accept the counsellor psychologically. The counsellor must be able to listen well and communicate effectively. If the counsellor's communication skills are weak, the counsellor will not be able to communicate the right meaning to the counsellee. If the counsellor is not a good listener, he will not be able to comprehend what the counselee says. There needs to be an atmosphere of trust and confidence between the counsellor and the counselee. Credibility and sensitivity of the counsellor are also key requirements. The required gestures. Face the client squarely. The counselor needs to face the client squarely that is sitting right in front of the counselee. The counselor should demonstrate openness by adapting a suitable posture. The counselor must lean forward, being sensitive to the client's personal space. The counselor must lean forward to show that he or she is interested in what the counselee is going to say. The counselor must maintain eye contact, showing interest and concern. The counselor must listen attentively and must stay relaxed throughout the conversation. That's all. Jazakallah.